tune was called Rocky Road to Dublin. The idea of including that tune is to get your fingers working on the bass strings, the 6th, 5th and 4th strings, and we also use the 3rd string, the G string, in that tune. Now it's an interesting tune to play. It's an unusual time, it's in 9-8 time. The easiest way to get familiar with the tune, with the rhythm, I think, is to think in terms of counting in threes. One and two and three and one and two and three and one and two and three and one and two and two and so on. We only have to use two fingers. All the work is done on the second fret and the third fret. So, as usual, our second finger is going to look after the notes on the second fret and our third finger is going to look after the notes on the third fret. Now, there's a short introduction and the introduction has five notes. It starts on the 4th string, 2nd fret. Play the 1st note twice. And then the 4th string open, the D string open. And then we move down to the 5th string, 2nd fret. And 5th string open. So play that a few times, it will help get the rhythm in, into your uh, mind. Now the first part of section 1, it starts off with the open E string, 6th string, followed by two notes on the open 5th. Next note is the 2nd fret 5th, and the next note is 3rd fret 5th. So, so 1, and 2, and 3. Next note is 4th string open and then we repeat the introduction so so far next note 5th string 3rd fret followed by 5th string 2nd fret then we move to the 6th string 3rd fret for two notes. Back to the fifth string open, and that's the second fret, second finger. Then we move to the, to the fourth string open, similar fingering, open second, and then select the introduction. So that's section one. So we'll Try that again. Now we move on to section two, which initially is identical to section one. Here's where it changes. Now we're going to do a bit of work on the second fret of the fourth and third strings. So, 4th string, 2nd fret, 3rd string, 2nd fret, for 2 notes, back to the 4th string, back to the 3rd string, open. So that little sequence is, and you play that 3 times. down to the from 4th, 5th and 6th. So next note is 4th string, 2nd fret, and 4th string open. 5th string, 2nd fret, 6th string, 3rd fret. Then 5th string open, 5th string, 2nd fret, 4th string open, and then back to that little sequence again. Coming near the end of the section now, so it's 5th string open and then 5th string 2nd fret. Then 4th string open and 4th string 2nd fret. And then finish off like the introduction. Last section then is 
back to section one. Just finish with a little A minor chord at the end. Now there's a lot of repetition in the, which can be confusing in that tune. I would suggest you listen to it and to the practice file a number of times and take small sections at a time and work on that. <laughs>